are talking about Face ID on the iPhone 10, um, which is a great, great feature. Once you start using it, you won't even be able yeah. to live without it. And it was so funny because, you know, everybody was saying before they actually came out, it doesn't work, you know, yeah. it's terrible. I am telling you, it is as easy as I just pick my phone up and I start working. Right. It's amazing. You're going to love it. Let's take a look. So here we are on the iPhone 10, and let's talk about what is Face ID anyway? Yeah, what is it? It's similar. It's just, you know, it's exactly Touch ID, but it's Face ID. So now your face is the password, which Woo! is super cool, right? That's so cool. So let me show you how easy this is. I'm going to put my phone down and turn the lock screen off. Are you on that? Yep. Look at that. Just as easy as that, the padlock. All I have to do, watch what, you down here? Yep. Let's watch that again. It unlocks. So now I'm going to show you how to set up the Face ID. Now, of course, when you get your brand new phone, it will walk you through the steps. But we've already done that, so I'm going to show you how to uh, redo it. And you can redo this at any time, too. If you don't want to do it when you first get your phone and you want to do it later, you can do that. By, I'm going to go ahead and tap on Settings. I'm going to go in there and I'm going to scroll down until I see Face ID and Passcode. I'm going to tap on that. I'm going to enter my passcode. And no, that's not my real passcode. <laughs> good, all zeros, not yeah. good. Um, till I, and I'm scroll down till I see set up face ID. Now if you're resetting it, it will say reset face, face ID. So you can do that at any point too. I'm gonna tap on that. And this works much like, uh, just like when you set up your thumbprint for thumbprint ID, you, the thumbprint would come up and you would sit there and move your thumb around on it until it read it enough. Works the same way, we're gonna show you. So it takes a while, I'm gonna hit get started. Okay, so it sees my face. And now I'm just gonna roll my eyes out. There you go, I got that. First ID complete. So it's gonna launch another one. I'm gonna hit okay. You look so gorgeous. Don't I? <laughs> the magic mirror, it's got that 3D effect around you. Follow the arrows. Oh, it's telling me where to go. Get up there. Come on, complete. Oh, up there. There we there go. There we go. He got it. Jeez, I like that it showed the arrows, you know what to do. Yeah. Face ID is now set up. We're all done. So let's, now we've set up the face ID. Let's take a look at the settings. It's got some nice settings. So of course it's in the settings app and then you scroll around to so see face ID and passcode. And I'm gonna hit my fake code, right? Some nice settings. So this is saying, it says use face ID for for iPhone unlock. Yes, definitely. I want that. Apple Pay, my one of my favorite things in the world, right? Right. Yes, I want that on. iTunes in the App Store. So when I'm at the App Store buying an app, you remember how if you had a phone with Touch ID, Touch ID, you used your thumbprint. Now you just look at it and it does it. And um, Safari Autofill, that will do it there too. And there's this other app. So I'm going to tap on that. You can see it says five apps. And what I've been finding with my phone is as I go into new apps, it will say, do you want to use Face ID? And I'll say yes. And then the next time I go into any one of these apps, instead of having to sign in or do Touch ID or anything, it will do Face ID. So it's pretty awesome. Now if we go down here, require attention for your face. You can see that it says true depth camera will ride an additional level of security by verifying that you are looking at the iPhone before unlocking. So that's a good thing to have on. Some sunglasses may block attention. Now, I've noticed my um, Tiffany sunglasses that I have are fine. Oh. <laughs> I haven't found one yet, but um, there are some it says that will not work. Attention awareness features. You can see that it says true depth camera will check for attention before dimming the display or lowering. I like having this on. I found when I had this off, um, it would dim right away. It'd go to sleep quicker. Yeah, yep. but this lets it know, you know, as long as you're looking at it, that you're still looking at it, even right. though you haven't touched it and it doesn't want to dim. Here's where we showed you to reset, Here's, and then we get into our passcode stuff. Right. So, so there's some really nice um, settings. Another really nice thing about the touch, the, the face ID, not the touch ID, that's the old thing, right? Right. Is um, the notifications. See how when I'm not looking and it doesn't see me, okay, right. so okay. it's locked. It, said, it just says, note, it just says messages from Barbara and it doesn't say what it is. Right. Now say it's an Instagram notification. It'll say Instagram notification 
or Facebook notification. Right. Okay. But then when I pick it up and it recognizes me, it'll tell me what the notification is. Isn't that great? Yeah. So if it was uh, an Instagram one, it would say, you know, so-and-so liked your post or whatever. Because right. everybody likes my post, right? Right. And here it's showing you the yeah. actual message or mm -hmm. at least the preview of the message is right. coming through. So that's a really, really nice feature. Your notifications are, are, are um, they're, they're kept to yourself. They're private until you look at your phone. Right. Now, the other cool thing is Apple Pay using Face ID. So what to do that, to get the Apple Pay, I'm going to hit double tap the power button. On the right side, On double the right tap side, the power brings button. It up. Oh. oh, and did you see that? It read my face. Right. It's it as it. easy as that. Now it's saying hold near the reader. If I was in a store, you know, I would put that like that. Right. And it would read it. That's how easy Apple Pay is with Face ID. So it's just so easy. I mean, when I first got it, I thought you'd oddly stare at it or something like that, but you don't. It just right. works so intuitive. It's and the other thing that, that's nice to note is that this, this face scan of yours, mm -hmm. some people are a little nervous about having their face scanned and so on and so forth, but it's kept only on the phone. It is not ever sent to iCloud or anywhere else over the internet. It's only on your phone. Right. And it was the same way with the Touch ID that your fingerprint never went anywhere. Right. So it's not even in iCloud. So it's so super secure and it's so easy to use. I find that I just pick up my device and I start using it. I don't even think about the fact that it's scanning my face. That's how great it works. Right. I can't wait to have it on my iPad too. Oh, I know. And everywhere, right? Right. So uh, we hope you enjoy using Face ID and thanks for learning with Sing Sisters. Well, thanks for watching our video today. We so love making these videos and bringing you this free content, but we do need your support. Right. So how can you support us? First of all, don't skip the commercials. That's how any creator makes money on YouTube. Um, like our video, share it with your friends, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And another great way is to go to our website using the link on the screen and um, shop through our Amazon link. Same secure Amazon shopping that you love at no extra cost, but it really helps support us to bring you these great videos. Right. So thanks for learning with us and thanks for supporting us.